Hello, and welcome to my YouTube video. This is the Brett Skinner fish tank. So I'm going to start out over here. That's one of my bishers. Just getting out and about, enjoying life. So if you have not ever seen my YouTube videos, I do RC videos. I do fish tank videos of my fish tank, which I'm currently doing. That there is Jaws. He is my red Texas cichlid. He came from PetSmart. Yes, that is correct. That fish came from PetSmart. I think he's absolutely beautiful, and he's actually getting oranger with time. Coming over here, I have a Red Hook Silver Dollar. He is the newest addition to the tank. If you've been watching my tank videos, this is the first time you've ever seen this fish, because I literally just picked that fish up three days ago. So... There's the other silver dollar that gets chased all the time by Megalodon. He needed a buddy, so I thought what more appropriate than getting another silver dollar for him. And then as we come down here, that is Megalodon. Dun -dun -dun -dun. He is a dovi, aka wolf cichlid. If you can see there, he's got a nice big old mouth sucker punch on his forehead. That is because Jaws put him in his place yet again. Yes, this is a common story now. He's getting big enough that Jaws is starting to patrol him a lot heavier and keeping him in check that much harder. There's nothing wrong. It's just that Jaws is the king of this tank. Yes, that guy right there runs this tank. If there's any fish in this tank that he doesn't approve of, they don't live. If there's any fish who like to bully other fish, he bullies that fish. Yes, I've seen him bully Plecos. I've seen him bully Megalodon. I've seen him get the silver dollars away from the food. He is the king of the tank, and he is a pretty boy. Sorry, my thing is in the way there. But yes, this tank also just recently got a new heater added to it right there. It got a new Fluval FX6 so this tank is doing a lot better it was a big investment that needed to get done I just got it done so up top there you see all that awesome greenness I actually hate this stuff basically I got some plants from my fish store and I ended up with one of those yes just like one or two of those and they've now become that I know it's not the worst thing ever but it's also not the most appealing thing that I like to refer to as the death clover of the fish tank yes I absolutely hate it you can take that stuff out by the pounds and it will grow back the death clover is a nightmare to my tank. I absolutely hate it. I got some new rock to the fish tank. And I still have that crappy plastic decor. Yes, I need to get rid of that. But that amount of rock right there you're looking at, that's like 75 bucks worth of rock. It's ridiculous how expensive rock is to buy. $4.99 a pound for that look of rock. So... Yeah, not really a big fan of the price and scheme of rocks in the aquarium hobby. So also in here, I do have some big plecos. You can see one kind of there. There's two of them, and of course Jaws has to get on camera. He says, no, you're going to look at me. I'm the pretty boy. You just look at them pretty colors of me. So there are two of those big common plecos in here. They were rescues. And then there's also a ornate bicher, which you'll have to watch on certain videos because he doesn't always come out. He likes to stay under his hidey hole. Yes, those rocks are his hidey hole. Give you a close up of Megalodon. Beautiful wolf cichlid getting that blue and green coming in nicely. And he is going to get big guys if you think you can go out and get a dovi cichlid you are wrong this fish is only a year old and he is already pushing 
what, six, seven inches? He's massive. Oh yeah, and then right over there is the Pictus cat. He came out for a second and I wasn't paying attention. But yes, that is a Pictus cat. I have one of those in there as well. So, I just wanted to update you. 2019, still doing some changes to the tank as always. Fish are doing well, getting some upgrades. And everything is still thriving and kicking. Not a whole lot has changed with this tank. But then again, not a whole lot can always change with this tank. So anyways, thank you for admiring my fish. Thank you for listening to my rant and rave about how amazing my fish are and how much I appreciate them and enjoy them on a daily basis. If you have any comments, suggestions, or anything of such a nature, please leave, feel free to leave a comment down in the comment section below. If you have not clicked the subscribe button, please do so that you can know when I'm gonna upload pictures and videos of my Pictus cat, my Dovi, watch him grow, make sure he's doing well, make sure he's not being too big of a bully, my red hook piranha family, and of course Jaws who now is over in the far corner. Oh look, I said Jaws and look who's coming over. Come here, Jaws! Jaws, come here, boy! So anyways, thanks again for taking time out of your day to watch my YouTube fish up update on the tank. And as always, I hope you have a great week. I hope this helped your day. Thank you, and come again.